Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Plants vs. Zombies. I'm gonna apologize right now, um, I, remember, I still don't exactly have a professional setting I can do this in, so... Sometimes I get, uh, sounds and voices in that really aren't supposed to be in there. I'm sorry if anybody is bothered by this, I try my best to cut it out. But, there's only so much I can do. Anyways, we got our new plant, the Doom Shroom. Possib- I call this one of the worst plants of the game, honestly. I really just don't like it at all. Anyways, for the next level, um, I gotta show off the Doom Shroom, so... You won't let me see how many flags, I. Eh? Excuse me. Um, I'm gonna go for this, 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 and I have no way to attack now other than that, so I'll need something like... Well, that one's gonna be a one-time deal, and that's it, so... This. Alright. Doom and gloom, ready to go. Come on, just plant. Um, in this episode, though, I did want to give a shout out to some people I know. I'm gonna have to look over the list, and I'm just gonna give off their usernames from us. Well, not their whole us usernames, parts I personally call them by. Just to kind of give a thanks to any of the support they give, either by watching the videos or simply just by being who they are. Damn airplanes. Actually, I don't think the airplanes come out, but I know for a fact that the uh, trains do. <laughs> oh man, that sucked when that happened. Um, but anyways, I'm gonna give it a shot now. This might work out funky on the sound. Um, first one is one who watches my videos heavily. And while he admitted at first I was definitely not his favorite Let's Player, after he saw this, he definitely, I think, put me up in his, like, top three. I call him Drake. He's been a good friend of mine for a long time now. Um, shoot. I, it's gonna be hard for me to look at my computer screen and this at the same time. Uh, I got a new friend named Ryan as well. I want to thank him for the times he's watched already. He's been a good friend for me. And I'm I'm trying to say a little bit without giving too much details away. Because they have no idea I'm doing this. And I want to be respect respectful about their privacy. Oh, shit. Okay, we're gonna probably be showing off that little boom, doom, gloom, zombie, uh, not zombie, mushroom a little bit early. All I need is, okay, this is what it does. Kaboom! Doom. However, it leaves a crater. I can't plant anything in that crater, and while I think it heals over time, it's still a big flippin' pain. And I really need a repeater. Somebody give me the... Son, I need for the repeater, please. Okay, there we go. Come on, that wasn't enough. Don't, don't plant it. I don't know if I planted it in time. No, he's probably... Okay, he's not even going to get the first one. All right, that's good. That's real good. Okay, eat that. I'm going to start replacing the free mushrooms, if I can, with the fume shroom. Because I know there's going to be screen door zombies that I'm going to have to deal with. And that's going to be a pain, but it's going to be a doable pain. And I keep putting them down in the wrong spot. Well, at least wrong spot opposed to where the zombies appear. And I know they're probably going to be focusing on the top soon. I mean, right? Right? Ah, oh, well. Uh, I guess for now I'm going to put a sunflower there just to try and get a little extra sun out if I can help it. Brave Buster. I ain't afraid no brave. <laughs> and, okay, no, my screen just dimmed. Um, I gotta have to go back to the friends in a little bit. I can't really give thanks and maintain a good yard defense at the same time, sadly enough. Yeah, my attention is somewhat divided. But yeah, because of that crater there, and maybe I can plant... Nope, still can't. It's healing, yes, but I still can't. But because of that, I do not like the Doom Shroom whatsoever. It's one thing if I were to use it, like, right here, but it's the same cost as a Cherry Bomb, and I'm not exactly, exactly sure what the dimensions are here. We'll find out, even. 
Okay, it does a huge range, but it's really only even somewhat decent at the very beginning. And I think we'll probably get something later on that'll replace in usefulness for damaging the zombies up front, but... For now, it's okay. I would still never use it after we get much better items, but... For now, it's okay. Um, I'm, okay, now that I have a decent defense, I'm gonna just leave myself by the sunflowers. And with that, I need just another fume shroom. And I'm also gonna take a look on those other names. Oh yeah, another name. Um, I guess we've been on again, off, of off again kind of friends, because we haven't really spoken a lot lately. We fight sometimes, but we're both normally in the same boat. Real good people who... Just get a lot of crap thrown at us for no reason. I meant to put the Great Buster there. <laughs> but his name's Gig, as I call him. He's been a good friend to me. Um, and I know you're... <laughs> I bet a lot of you are thinking, well, wait a minute, wait a minute. How do I get all these girls that actually want to do Let's Plays with me? And yet, I'm naming off only guys so far. I'm not going to have a big list, mind you. Oh, shit. Come on, kill, kill the Michael Jackson zombie, please. And I might not be right on this, but I think I know one useful thing about the fume shroom now. I think it penetrates through other zombies. Yeah, I think it does. I think it penetrates past other zombies, so it'll do a whole line's worth of damage. I'm pretty sure on that. Yeah, I'm pretty sure, be just because this guy's getting hit back here. So therefore, he might actually be a pretty good defense against the Michael Jackson thriller, thriller zombies right there, because these three will just get hit all the time. Though. I don't think I really went over how the uh, Michael Jackson zombie is such a huge problem. It's because he can summon up those other zombies, and because of where he summons them. A row down and a row up. You're not going to have the same defense here sometimes as you do here. You'll see what I mean later on, and sometimes that just won't happen at all, but again, you'll see later on. I, I don't want to spoil a lot. Oh, I should be grave busting. Shoot! Oh, I definitely want to give a shout out to Julian. He is by far my biggest supporter. He is the guy that you guys might have seen in the SLAI Let's Plays. Okay, okay that was close. That was real close. Yeah, he co-commentated with me once, and that's something none of my other friends can say they've done. I'll even put a fusion right there, no freebie, why not? And hell, I'll even go boom. It's the end of the chapter, so why not? And now we have another seed pack. Oh, don't tell me. Not a, you sons of, mm. They keep writing these on back of seed packets, I swear. <laughs> Hello. We would like to visit for a midnight snack. How does ice cream and brain sound? Sincerely, the zombies. P.S. Please stop beating us and lowering our intelligence. This is going to be interesting. <laughs> this is going to be very interesting. A little luck factor with the gravestone. Oh, I hate this Doom Shroom. Wait, much They are giving me shit after shit after shit. Oh, God. This is one of the only times I consider this like a boss fight. Simply because you are going to have the football zombie in here and you're going to have to deal with crap plants to use. You got a lot of junk, honestly, in this chapter. Another Doom Shroom, but I think I'll hold on to that. A lot of temporary solutions to permanent problems here is, or TPS as Nintendo Capri Sun called it, but the thing is, and finally, something of use. Freeze. The thing is, a lot of these aren't all that good because we don't have shooters out, like the Freezing them's not going to do unless we have some, something to shoot them. The Grave Buster, while it will indeed get rid of the uh, gravestones and give, give you money, it's not going to attack anything. It's just going to save your ass for later, I guess. But again, for later. And as you see, that zombie will think other zombies are plants and trying to eat each other. Alright, another 
Scaredy Shroom there, a Free Puff there, and okay, it looks like we can depend on that to not eat our Puff Shroom. Oh, see, okay, no, the Fume Shroom I meant did live, so we're fine there for now. I still find this kind of hard, if nothing more, because... Oh, is it going to make... Oh, it just barely made it. I just more find it hard because, again, you have such awful means of offense here, and you are going to be facing that football zombie. However, you do have the Doom Shroom, so... Yeah. You can argue it's not that bad with them, but I still hate using the Doom Shroom. Oop, another Grave Buster... And since I have to use something for now, I'm just going to use the Ice Mushroom. That one will freeze the Screen Door Zombie, as you can see. I think the reason why it doesn't affect the Screen Door Zombie is because they're tossing it at the Screen Door, while as the Mushroom kind of covers every inch of their entire lawn. So I guess that's one way to make logic work in that situation. And I'm going to actually start putting those little... Hypno shrooms down just as that was not a hypno shroom. <laughs> I was feeling my controller vibrate. It's like what the hell? It's like boom. And I'm like, oh crap! I hit the wrong button. Okay, I need to freeze that guy. Oh, so much for freezing him again. I wanted to just freeze him again, not blow him up. Whatever. If we're gonna take them out, if they're taking my lawn out, I'll take them with me. Boom! I know I say hate the Doom Shroom, yet what am I using now all the time? Alright, and that should get rid of a lot of the graves. Not all, mind you, but a lot. And seeing as we have no Hypno Shroom we can use over here, I'm just gonna add the Freeman on from that row. Might not make it in time. Oh, just barely did for both of them. That was lucky. Pretty sure. Okay, there's the Hypno Shroom. And we have another Hypno Shroom. Oh, oh wait, wait, let him eat it. Not the right. Oh, I wanted our Michael Jackson zombie. I probably should have saved it for something like you. Actually, I'd be interested to see who would win a uh, screen door versus football zombie. Probably the football zombie, but still. I want to see. For now, we just have explosion. After explosion. After explosion. What's eaten on who? Oh, never mind. It's a most wonderful winter wonderland. <laughs> I'm just more trying to free up space. I really don't consider all these guys too much of a here. And yeah, they do keep the little iced over effect after you freeze them. Oh, that's interesting. He spawned them all the way back there. Freeze. Cool party. Chill. Well, they did say we were gonna have an ice cream party, I guess. Alright, our snacks. I can't remember. My brain's dead. Uh, speaking of dead, how about we make you all undead? Actually, they are undead. What am I talking about? <laughs> I don't even know what happened to my brain. I think one of these zombies here ate it. Well, the screen door zombies did say they'd go after me and one one time or something. I say blow them all to hell. Can I just get one more grave rod? Oh well, so much for one more grave rod. I know I can end here with the Doom Shroom, but I really want that last grave. Oh, ooh, perfect, perfect. I just gotta let everything else go by. I had her get a freezing one. Oh, 
come on, get rid of the football guy. That does it. And now I can just plant Doom Shroom and boom. I got two birds with one mushroom, I guess. Alright, uh, I know it kind of seems like a short episode, and that's exactly why right now I'm going to be going over to the Almanac. And I think we have a neighbor to visit. Crazy Dave, I haven't forgotten what you do with zombies and how you left me in the lurch with all of them. If you want to do that stuff with them, that's fine, but don't force them on me, damn it. <laughs> Looks like the zombies gave up attacking your front yard. Now they're trying your backyard. And to top it all off, you can't even use your mushrooms. They weren't that good. The puff shrooms, mind you, were great. But after that, not too much. Because they'll fall asleep during the day. Well, isn't that just dandy? Wait, wait, I just thought of one plant type I don't think they ever use here that they obviously overlooked for a lawn situation. Dandelions! Why are there no dandelions in this? Really, come on, it couldn't have been that hard. You could have made it look like a chomper, maybe. Was it really that hard? Whatever. Anyways, we're going to be finishing this episode off with a little funny tidbits from the Almanac. Okay. Oh, wrong one. Puffshroom. I only recently became aware of the existence of zombies, says Puffshroom. Like many fungi, I just assumed they were fairy tales or movie monsters. This whole experience has been a huge eye-opener for me. Zombies are real, kids. Believe it. Or should I say... No, not even I would dare quote that awful character. Oops, wrong one. Okay, mm, before I get a lot of fan hate, I will say this one. By awful character, I mean the kid version. I mean the kid version was awful. Okay, anyways. Sunshroom. Sunshroom hates sun. He hates it so much that when it builds up in his system, he spits it out as fast as he can. He just won't abide it. To him, sun is crass. Did I read that right, crass? I guess. I was in a dead-end job, producing yeast spores for a bakery, said Fume Shroom. Then Puss Shroom, bless him, told me about this great opportunity blasting zombies. Now I real feel now I really feel like I'm making a difference. I wanna see Grave Rots. I Grave Buster, alright, Grave Buster. I don't remember it, but I just love this guy either way. Despite Grave Buster's fearsome appearance. No if I'm gonna do that voice, I'm gonna do it better. Despite Grave Buster's fearsome appearance, he wants everyone to know that he loves kittens and spends his night off and spends his off hours volunteering at a local zombie rehabilitation center. It's just the right thing to do, he says. <laughs> uh, I actually love the Batman movies, with the exception of the last. I just hate the idea of a non-super buffy Bane. It just makes no sense to me. To me. Zombies are our friends, asserts Hypno Shroom. They're badly misunderstood creatures who play with play a variable role in our economy. I mean ecology. I mean ecology. Uh, uh, what's that word say, Matt? Uh, you got any munchies? We can and should do more to bring them around to our way of thinking. Who's there? Whisper Scaredy Shroom, voice barely audible. Go away! I don't want to see anybody, unless it's the man from the circus. Wait, what? I swear that's a movie quote or something. Somebody tells me what it- somebody please, in the comments, what- what is he talking about? Ice Shroom frowns, not because he's unhappy or because he disapproves, but because of a childhood injury that left his facial nerves paralyzed. Let me guess that disease was hypothermia. Kidding. I know it's not a disease, people. You're lucky I'm on your side. 
says Doomshroom. I could destroy everything you hold dear. It wouldn't be hard. Another reason why I don't like Doomshroom. <laughs> He, yeah, he does massive damage, and it's a wide scale, but just that crater, that crater, mm -mm, no. Anyways, in the next episode of Plants vs. Zombies, you know what I say? I say we having a pool party, y'all. Bring the, bring the dogs, bring the women, bring the wieners, bring the everything. <laughs> I'll just bring the gameplay and commentary, if even the commentary. I'll see you guys for the next episode. Goodbye.